go. They wouldn't let me go before you. I don't know what that means. But. First and owner. All right, we are going to roll right into our post-race um, interviews. We are now joined by our regular season champion, driver of the number 19 Joe Gibbs Racing Toyota, Martin Truex Jr. Um, Martin, you won the inaugural uh, regular season championship. You just won your second. Um, how does it feel to have this momentum going into the playoffs? Yeah, thanks. It feels great. I mean, obviously, uh, you know, at the beginning of the year, you set out to you know, be the best. And, uh, you know, for the regular season championships, a huge deal. The 15 points that come along with it are really uh, very, very, very important uh, for the playoffs. So um, just really proud of my team, thankful, you know, to turn it around from last year, missing the playoffs to being being here tonight is, uh, is a big deal for, for all of us. So thankful to all our partners and everybody, um, you know, that makes this happen. And, uh, you know, hopefully we can keep this going throughout the playoffs. All right, we will go ahead and open it up to questions. We'll go ahead and start up here with Chris and then go to Lee. Hey, Martin, congratulations, first of all. Uh, Chris Collin with um, WNDB. Uh, I'm curious, um, did you run that race any differently knowing the regular season championship and the 15 bonus points were well within your grasp from the green flag? Yeah, for sure. I mean, I think, you know, early on we, um, you know, we kind of tried to do all we could to stay at the front and, and you know, was fortunate enough to, have our teammates around us and be able to get the stage one win. That was a big deal. And then, you know, as soon as the 11 car had his issue uh, in stage two and we kind of got shuffled back a little bit, I felt like I was in a really bad spot. Um, I decided to bail and, and luckily, you know, I, I did because they, you know, huge pile up a few laps later. So um, didn't really get to race the way I wanted to once we, you know, kind of got in that position, the 11 and was lapped down, and we just kind of had to be smart about it. That was not a whole lot of fun, but we had to do what we had to do. So we definitely raced different than we would have, um, you know, had the 11 not had his issues. Lee? <clears throat> Lee Spencer, CashFence.com. Just curious, it, it seems like every time we come to Daytona Talladega, the Fords are just lights out. I know you're kind of looking for your first super speedway win, but what do you observe from your – keen eye that you see with those cars that Toyota's just missing a little bit other than strength in numbers? Yeah, there's a few things. I think strength in numbers is one. I think, you know, obviously they're really fast. Um, you know, they're low drag compared to us, I would say, and that, you know, is kind of why, you know, we show up maybe at some better downforce tracks so a little bit faster. Um, and also, I think another key is they can just push really well with their bumpers the way they line up. So our cars are fast. Um, my car was really fast tonight. We just, we don't have a lot of people that want to work with us, and our cars are a little bit squirrely when pushing or getting pushed. Um, that's a, you know, that's a kind of a, just one of those things we have to deal with. Um, so it's it's a, it's a few different things. They have great drivers as well, and um, you know they have a good game plan. They stick together, so they're they're tough to beat here for sure. You're not a real emotional guy, but from missing last year to being the regular season point champion. What does that say? I mean, it's just a testament to how the 19 buckled down and went to work. Yeah, no question. I think, you know, the 19 team, not only that, but uh, everybody, JGR, TRD, Toyota, just as a whole, you know, as a group. I mean, you know, to we've won a lot more races this year and, and had a lot more speed across the board with all of our cars. And, you know, for me, just my guys really buckling down, like you said, and, and finding things that I need, finding things that, that stuck out that uh, we could work on for me have has been a huge help. So just uh, it's fun to go to the track and have, you know, know they're going to give me something I can go out and win with almost every single weekend. And, um, you know, we didn't have that last year, but uh, it's it's a lot of fun to race that way. And, and we've got it right now. Hopefully we can have it for 10 more, 10 more weeks and um, go out on top here. Thanks. Do we have any questions in the press box? No questions in the press box. Awesome. Thanks. Do we have any other questions down here? All right, Martin, congratulations and thank you for your time.